don't have to bother untying it. You can just wrap it over. So all you do is you're not going to muscle the rope. Bring you're going to keep the ropes. If the rope gets too much slack in it, you're going to bring that on deck. But your main focus should be that white float at the end of the recovery line. Doing good. A little bit You know where the parachute is, right? Okay, yeah. good, excellent. Excellent, you're keeping good management of the parachute. So you got the hang out of the second time around. Beautiful. Beauty. Yeah, there you go. And then remember you fold it one time for the most part. Like this? Yes. Crowd line's in the center of the parachute canopy with the hardware hanging out at the bottom. Hanging out about like that. That's fine. And then you fold the, the, the canopy material over the shroud lines. One time's fine. That's fine. And then you go to the top of the parachute and roll it like a sleeping bag. What? You got your, there you go. Good. You're managing where all your lines are, and that's all it takes. Yeah, I've done a lot of sailing. Managing lines, I'm good at it. Hey, that's all you have to do. It. And then you go to the top of the trip line like anything else, pour the line. Now in bumpy weather, all you're going to do is grab your chute, throw it in a bag, and drop it in the um, anchor storage there, and that's it. Get going. Keeping all your lines attached and so forth. <laughs>